Lehigh's Nick Macnione threw nine hitless frames in an 11-inning no-hitter in February. It was the highlight of his season until Sunday. The senior Southpaw didn't throw a no-no, but his 10 innings of solid pitching was just what Lehigh needed to win its first Patriot League title since 2006. Macnione was touched up for a pair of runs in the fourth, and Navy tied the game at three in the seventh on a triple. But in the other eight innings, he kept the mids off the board. You know, my coaches told me to go out there and give them every inning I had. And um, when, when I got into the late innings, they told me that they wanted me out there when, when the game was over. And, you know, that's kind of what I needed to dig a little deeper and get the job done. But, you know, I was just out there to give my team a shot to win. And, you know, my defense behind me was incredible. They kept me in the ball game. Kids dominated all year. Um, we expected no different from him today. Um, and that's what happened. Knowing Nick personally, he's been working for this for so long, every day in the gym, every day at practice. I couldn't be happier for him, and he came through when we needed him most. With the suspension of Game 2 on Saturday, Coach Sean Leary debated using Macchione when it resumed on Sunday, but he held him back in case he needed him for Game 3. That was one of the toughest decisions this morning. Do you bring him out in the 10th in the inning and just go with your, with your senior leader at that point, or do you trust that our bullpen that's been so great all year can lock one down and get us a win? And, we made the smart choice. We gave ourselves two chances to win with Colby in the first game, and then we knew Nick Mack had everything that was left in the tank he was going to give us today. And But that's that's a performance for the ages. I mean, your senior year, you're in a championship moment, you go extra innings, and you, and you shut him down in the ninth, and then that tenth inning after <laughs> after kind of a tough air there, he just he just gutted it out. And I just, again, so, so proud of his effort today. Lehigh took the 4-3 lead in the top of the tenth. And with 102 pitches in the books, Macchione walked out to the mound to pitch the bottom of the tenth to lock down the win. After getting the leadoff hitter to foul out, he struck out Travis Blue to put Lehigh on the cusp of the championship. Robert Curry, however, legged out an infield error and stole second to move into scoring position. But Macchione dug deep and struck out Brad Borisek to clinch the title in dramatic fashion. The senior leader was determined to go back out in the 10th and win it. They, they came up to me and told me that there was a lefty going out there and they asked me if I wanted to continue. And I told them that I was going back out there for sure. You know, I, I knew there was guys in the pen behind me that were ready to get the job done if I couldn't, but I just went out there and, and gave it everything I had. Macchione earned all tournament honors for his performance, and he'll join the rest of the Lehigh Mountain Hawks as they head to the NCAA Tournament Regionals. The full bracket will be released on May 25th on NCAA.com. For the Page League Network, I'm Melanie Pulowski.